Mercury in Retrograde by Rachel Stewart, Stewart has. So, <laughs> um, in other ways, the stars can teach you to love your truth, find your power, and hone, call up the universe. I'm really bad at my writing shit. <laughs> Uh, so, you get an intro covering the basics, understanding transit, planet, planet, planets in the houses, eclipses, retrograde, real talk, understanding the aspects, asteroids, and Chiron. I would have likely butchered if butchered Chiron if um, I haven't been watching Sarah Verba. <laughs> um, Harness your moon wisdom, tips and tricks to take your practice further, and look to the stars. Um, so, conclusion. Um, so, you get like a little paragraph, uh, come on, a little intro to the planets, and like you get their symbol. You get a bit more when it comes to the zodiac signs and then like elements and like the zodiac signs that are so like the fire element aries leo and sagittarius and then it goes into the other ones <coughs> so planetary transit timeline so like um speed um, moves at own speed and pace around the astro astro astrology wheel me and words um, so how long like they would take each planet so the Sun one year moon 28 days uh, Pluto 248 years um, and then like it will go into like that aspect um, and then like with the houses um, you get the first house and then planets and then second house planets so it isn't set up like Sun 1 to 12, moon 1 to 12, it's the house and then the planets. So, um, some people may not like that setup, um, where others will, would like this setup. And then you get, um, like north node in Aries, um, in Aries or first house, so slash south node in Libra or the seventh house, north node in Terrace or second house, slash south node in Scorpio or eighth house. And he gives a little bit of information about um, those. Like if you're born in a retrograde, it gives you some information about that. Um, information about like the outer planets. Um, major aspects, so like conjunction, tiring, minor aspects, um, Circes, and then it goes like in like, um, in, in each house. Um, so it does that for a few different other, um, aspects. So, it's a lot of information thrown at you, but it's like briefly discussed. It's a good introductory type of book to um, like astrology and like the houses, if um, and, like all the aspects, if that is something that you want to explore further. Um, so, and it's a good jump off point, point for like for the research, like if you want to explore further of like the CRC or like the nods or whatever 
this may be like a book that you may first see them and so you can go further looking at those so overall it's a really like I think it's a really nice book for people on their astrology journey that want to go full-blown make it a focus in their life so yeah Mercury in retrograde happy readings